Hello everyone, and welcome to my The Young and the Restless official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Spoilers for Wednesday, March 6 episode of The Young and the Restless indicate that Victor and Nikki Newman will respond to some troubling news. That will most likely cover Jordan's involvement in Seth Morgan's hit-and-run accident. Nikki could receive updates regarding the customer who said that Seth threw himself in front of the car and instructed Nikki to accept his apology. Nikki will understand Jordan must bear some of the blame for Seth's unfortunate outcome since she is aware that he did not wish to take his own life. Jordan's abandoned disguise could be discovered by the police in the dumpster, raising additional red flags for the Newmans. Nikki could be worried about what to do next because Jordan is going to be running in yet another get-up. Victor might believe that getting Claire Grace to speak with Jordan and continue setting up the remainder of his trap is more crucial than ever. According to additional Y and R spoilers, Danny Romolotti will surprise Michelle Stafford's character Phyllis Summers by showing up at society when she's prepared for him to prepare dinner. Rather than that, Danny is going to put a stop to the romantic evening that Phyllis has planned. Now that Danny has convinced Christine Blair that she is the right woman for him, he will actually want to establish some clear boundaries. Phyllis might have to give up on her quest because it appears that by the time Danny is done with her, she will be devastated. Next, Summer Newman and Chance Chancellor are going to land in a GCAC suite, therefore she's going to send out or accept a surprise invitation. Summer and Chance will talk about what they want for supper, but they will both be thinking about something hotter. Chance and Summer will probably hit the beds to enjoy some privacy as soon as they feel the heat. Stay tuned for additional details on this significant advancement in the bedroom, as spoilers for the young and the restless indicate that Chance and Summer have some sizzling moments coming ahead. According to spoilers for the young and the restless, Jordan lured Seth to the empty lounge. Maybe more characters will become involved as Jordan takes greater chances in his quest for retribution as Nikki Newman. Recently, Amanda Sinclair reminisced about her time spent at the pub, purely out of nostalgia, of course. Could it be that Jordan and Amanda cross paths and something unexpected happens? Amanda Sinclair provides spoilers for the young and the restless. Memories. According to Y and R spoilers, Amanda returned to Genoa City in order to assist Jill Abbott at Chancellor Winters. Amanda came into contact with Devin Hamilton, Phyllis Summers, and Billy Abbott. Indeed, Billy and Amanda recently discussed their time spent at the empty glass. Lie and R teasers. Seth was tricked. Following her release from prison, fans are aware that Jordan has been spending a lot of time at the empty glass. Jordan was able to exert control over Seth, who is just now beginning to inquire about Isabel. Jordan appeared to be impressed by Seth's ability to secure a meeting with Nikki. But Jordan's still hiding and giving Nikki the chills. It appears that Jordan is still having feelings for Seth. Spoilers for the young and the restless, Jordan hangs out. Spoilers for the young and the restless indicate that viewers anticipated Jordan to accompany Seth on his trip to the Newman Ranch. But that didn't take place. Jordan remained at the empty glass and later received a report from Seth. Jordan may encounter into more Geno City, locals the longer she stays at the empty glass. Lee and R spoilers. Risky crossover. Amanda might head out for a drink at the empty glass. Amanda might run into Jordan there. Amanda knows Nikki, of course. The Newman family is well known across Geno City. Amanda might not even be aware that Jordan is actually Isabel at this point. Will Jordan's plan for Nikki involve Amanda? Jordan might be anticipating it, even though Victor Newman would use Claire Grace as bait. Jordan has spent decades researching the patterns of the Newman family. Thus, when it comes to Jordan, be prepared for the unexpected. Why, in your opinion, is Jordan holding on to Seth? What is Jordan going to do next? And is Nikki going to make it through? Is Amanda the next to be drawn into Jordan's plan of retaliation? 
A preview clip has been published, according to the young and the restless spoilers for the week of March 4. In it, Manny Johnson and Amanda Sinclair are introduced. Jordan gets ready to see Nikki Newman again. Summer Newman Abbott and Chance Chancellor get fervent. Furthermore, Christine Blair learns that Danny Romolotti is moving out of Geno City. The young and the restless spoilers for the week of March 4 indicate that Jordan and Seth are featured in the preview clip, Jordan and Nikki Newman's duel. It now dawned on Nikki that Isabel and Jordan are one and the same. After learning of this insight, Nikki urged Seth to continue playing the villain and then report back to her. Seth tells Jordan to come outdoors in the teaser video. After leaving the glass lounge, Seth proposes that they give Nikki a call together. Jordan tells Seth to go ahead, even as she sounds anxious because she will enjoy their reunion. Spoilers for summons of Y and R. Arda. They'll get flirtatious and playful now that Chance and Summer are over. Chance asks Summer what he's feeling like doing right now, just to make fun of him. In a flirtatious reply, Summer says she hopes it's the same thing she's feeling like. Will Summons have a passionate night to remember, or will something unforeseen occur? Spoilers for the young and the restless. Amanda Sinclair vs. Manny Johnson. The Restless and the Young, the teaser for the week of March 4th, also features a confrontation, according to spoilers. When Mamie and Devon run across Amanda, they are in a group. Amanda welcomes Mamie, while Devon politely moves aside. Amanda is courteous, yet her voice is somewhat stiff. So, what will be Mamie's reaction to the woman representing Jill Abbott, Jess Walton? Spoilers for week of March 4th at Y and R. Fans might also catch a glimpse of Danny and Christine throughout the week of March 4. After learning that Danny was leaving town, fans had already witnessed Michelle Stafford's character, Phyllis Summers, go all in. Christine will then learn that Danny is moving out of Geno City. Is Danny really ready to end their relationship? Christine wonders. Which plot will you be most interested in witnessing during the week of March 4? For Summer, Chance, Devon, Mamie, and Amanda, what are your predictions? For Seth, Jordan, Nikki, Danny, Christine, Phyllis, and the other Geno City residents, what does the future hold? According to Young and the Restless Spoilers, Phyllis Summers, Christine Blair, and Danny Romolotti's love triangle plot has taken a strange turn. The storyline is now concentrating more on the ladies' rivalry and Danny's yearning for peace than it is on his conflicting feelings for Red, despite the fact that it appears like he does have feelings for the woman that he's attempting to brush off. Social media has the advantage of allowing viewers to interact with some of their favorite daytime drama actors, despite the fact that it can also be a poisonous hop of hate. A Y and R viewer recently shared their thoughts regarding the Red slash Bug slash Rockstar love triangle, and Michael Damien personally responded. Spoilers for the young and the restless. Michael Damien addresses a fan's concern that, despite some fans' enjoyment of the redesigned GC love triangle, others are growing impatient with it. Regardless of your allegiance to hashtag Team Christine or hashtag Team Phyllis, Danny's emphasis on maintaining harmony is a little grating, especially when viewers are itching for some romance. A fan posted something on X slash Twitter and mentioned Michael Damien in it. The star was asked to forward a note to the writers of Y and R by the user at Twinster 2. She went on to say that she gave the show another go because her mother, who had been a loyal fan from the beginning, had lately gone away. Y and R recap. Michael Damien's reaction. Michael quickly replied to the fan's post, assuring her that her message had been received loud and clear. In addition, he tweeted his condolences to her mother and mentioned Laura Lee Bell and the Y and R X account. Unlike Days of Our Lives, Y and R is filmed only a few weeks in advance, so storylines can be changed if they start to lag or receive unfavorable feedback from viewers. Now that we know that, will the soap opera act? So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.